what's going on everybody thanks for checking out passing through outdoors I actually take a look at the gunner crate um, this is my very first one I already looked in it uh, one thing I wasn't a hundred percent happy but I thought I ordered a different box the the bigger box and I didn't so that that's on me um, one thing I did notice, they tell you that every month on this box, which when I open it up, you'll see, it's it, the box itself is a target, and then they give you uh, a data card on each box that tells you different things about a gun. Here's the problem with that. The data card's here where all my shipping information is, so you can't see it. So there's one issue. Um, like I said, they have two separate boxes. Uh... The one thing about Gunner Crate, their shipping is like $13, $14. So they're the highest shipping rate out of any box that I've done. So, um, with that being said, we'll take a look at it. And here's what I was talking about. Each box is a target. They have contests. You shoot the target. You post it to Instagram. Um, you get a little swag bag. So this box was really heavy and I was thinking, oh man, you know, I'm going to get some neat stuff. I got 12 of these. These are targets. Um, they're called Pop Packs Multi-Variable Shooting System. Uh, 12 Pop Packs, 9 number decals. So it's multi-variable and responsive training aids creates thinkers first and shooters second. Uh, it's designed to challenge with, uh, it's got different colors, shapes, and numbers. High visibility gels uh, formulated for a highly visible signature that is water soluble, will not stain your clothes, and non toxic. So, they're different colors, different shapes, different numbers. Like I said, I got 12 of them in here. So, like, you got a circle. Um, this one here is a square. Yeah, that there. So, there's pink, yellow. And green are the colors. There's 12 of them, so you hang these, you set them up, you shoot them. Um, and I'm, I'm assuming they blow up. I haven't seen them yet. Um, I haven't checked them out online, seen any of the reviews or anything on these yet. Um, I'm assuming these were the numbers because I got stickers. So I got those in here as well, so I think those might be part of the system. So, like I said, I got like 12 of these in there. Um, they're called like once again pop packs so I'll be sure to hop online check them out um, got a trigger lock this is also made in China so made in China trigger lock so not happy about that um, just because every time you buy a handgun every time you buy a rifle you get some type of lock with it also, most people have gun cases, gun safes. They have their guns locked up already. Um, and, you, and you get a trigger lock with like every handgun that you buy. So the point of one and another, um, nobody wants that. So to send one out, and especially one that was made in China, that'll go straight in the trash. Um, gun and reel silicone cloth. So you're clean your firearm or reel with breakthrough military grade solvent. Wipe evenly over surface to allow silicone to form and protect the film. Uh, silicone cloth can be used multiple times. So it contains one wipe, 12 by 14. Prevents fingerprint print marks, protects against rust and corrosion, polishes wood and metal. So. One thing I was noticing the more I've been looking at their boxes. Um, they come with a lot of cleaning supplies. One of my recommendations to them would be less cleaning supplies for guns. Most people that shoot a lot, um, obviously they're buying, you know, a gun kit. They've already got one brand that they already like or that they're going to use regularly. And gun cleaner goes a long way. You know, one small tube, you can clean multiple, multiple guns with multiple times. So to get more gun cleaning stuff all the time, every single month, I think that's a little overboard. Um, so back off of that. So there you can see, you unfold this box, you get, you get that. Um, the shooter cards, like I said, are covered up, so 
that does you no good. Uh, so here's a three pack of hat liners. Instantly absorbs sweat. And so it's a sweat absorbing disposable hat liner. So you pop them in your hat. Um, they sell three different ones. They got a hard hat liner, a helmet liner, and a hat liner. These are the hat liners. So if you're outside shooting, obviously, since this is a gunner box, um, you'd put it inside your hat to prevent the sweat from going down into your eyes. Um, so the three items over here, you know, basically so far I feel like I paid like $65, $75 for targets, that the, these pop packs, which I haven't looked online yet to see how much those even cost. I'm assuming this hat liner, a dollar, two dollars. This gun cloth, four or five dollars. The gun lock, made in China, five dollars tops. Um, pig lube, little gun cleaning case here. So you got your little gun cleaning kit. They're nice to carry in your range bag. And they put the pig lube in here. So, this one has nothing written on it. Uh, I'm assuming it's some type of lube. So, overall, my first impression, this is my very first gunner crate. Um, this is the smaller box, and their smaller box, like I said, is like $50, but it's like $12 to $15 to ship the damn thing. Um, so, their shipping is extremely high, like I said. Highest out of any any box there is. Um, they say that they have five star ratings across the board. I don't know about that. Um, so you get this little bag. Everything in this bag is promo codes for stuff. So it's just them promoting other companies. Hey, come check these guys out. And then I got two paper targets. So really, out of this entire box, you paid for a small gun cleaning kit to throw in your range bag and targets. Because I don't see anybody using the lock. I mean, the gun, cloth, and the hat liners are... I don't know, I, I expected more out of Gunner Crate. So next month is the last chance if I get a crappy box like this, I, I wouldn't do it again. Um, like I said, for the price. like. If I'm going to spend $65 for targets, I better be getting some range time out of that. You know what I mean? Um, I don't spend that much to go to a range for three, four hours and shoot targets there. And that's what I spent on targets this month. So, first impression of Gunner Crate, I would avoid it. Um, like I said, for the price, $65, $70 I spent on this box for targets. Um... They claim to have five five star rating. I with a box like this, I wouldn't I wouldn't see that unless it's people that aren't in a state where they could just go buy gun stuff all the time. Um, that like I said, that that's my first impression. I would rate them two out of five with this box right here. Um, if that like it, that's a low low too. Like it's it's heading towards one. So we'll give them one more chance next month. Um, Hey guys, if you're going to say you got shooting cards on your box, don't cover them with a shipping label. That's uh, tip number one. Tip number two, don't send gun locks. Tip number three, stop sending so much cleaning supplies. Everybody that shoots already has all the cleaning supplies they need. Um, targets, hey, that's cool, but $65, $70 for targets, that's a bit overboard. So, um, like I said, this is passing through outdoors. First impression of Gunner Crate, Gunner, yeah, GunnerCrate.com. Um, I would avoid it. I'm giving them one more shot. Hopefully next month it's, it's good. Um, there's four or five different shooting boxes out there, and the reviews I've seen and the stuff I've gotten from those other boxes surpasses Gunner Crate, and they're cheaper. Gunner Crate is more expensive, more uh, the shipping's higher, and the products I got was the least, like, not the best. So, worst box, highest shipping, highest price. So, there's three things right there that's telling you to go to a different box. So, we, we'll see what happens next month. I'm hoping they surprise me. Um, I'll do the bigger box next month, and that's the last chance they get for me. So, thanks for checking out Pass Through Outdoors. Here's an update to the Gunner Crate. 
So if you go to their website, they insist that you get double the value in your box. So, went to brownells.com. Pop packs are $9.99. $10 for those 12 pop packs. Um, also, for the Gunner Crate, you get this card. You gotta go to a link to see what's inside. So, first thing in the box, $10. That was for the Triumph Systems Pop Packs. Uh, then the Pig Lube Range Kit. I know we've included lots of cleaning kits over the past few months, but we couldn't pass up the opportunity to include this badass range kit. The Pig Lube Range Kit comes complete with everything you need to keep the range day fun going all day and never have to call it early because of a dirty gun or even poorly manufactured infantry ammunition uh so la -da -da -da, the compact size range kit makes it easy to keep in your range bag glove box okay so pig lube range kit let's google this one see what we get oh let's see pig lube huh. so maybe that's where the value came out of this box that little range kit um 45 dollars is the price on piglube.net so that's where that came from I guess um, let's see when you go to Google Shopping um, there I found it for $24 uh, if you go to Google Shopping $24 um, if you go through Pig Lube $45 so even then you're, you're looking at $55 for this box um, next they had the Breakthrough Silicone Cleaning Cloth um, yeah, I don't like how you have to go through and search everything. Um, most boxes give you a card, well, every box gives you a card and tells you what's in the box and all that. Um, silicone, there it was, breakthrough silicone cleaning cloth. Five dollars. So, like I said, I didn't think it was, uh, too much money itself. Tactical performance metal trigger block. So, let's see this one. Metal trigger lock, dollar ninety nine. A dollar ninety nine for that metal trigger lock. There you go, a dollar ninety nine. So, uh, what else do we have in there? No sweat hat liner. Let's see them. No sweat hat liners, four dollars. Um, that was it for the box, right? Oh, the Baker's Target packet. Um, I don't know, man. This is, uh, <laughs> so double the value. This is what I'm getting at. So, they said double the value. We found this online. $25. $25. $10 for the targets. So, we're at $35. Now, we're at $40. $45. $45. Seven. Forty-seven dollars is the value in this box. So they guarantee, if you go to their website, we guarantee at least double the value for what you pay. Well, not including shipping, we didn't even hit the value. That's it. I mean, dude, Gunner Crate, what the hell, man? Five-star rating? I hope I'm... Please, I hope everybody sees this. You cannot say you have a five-star rating and you're getting double the value when you send a $2 lock, $5 bands, $5 cloth. And I even gave you the benefit of the doubt on this. I found multiple prices on this for $20 up to $45. But $20, you can find this. You don't even hit $50. And the box was more than $50 plus... 12 to 15 dollars to ship it so yeah you guys definitely um are i'm throwing the bullshit flag on your crate um so yeah thank thanks for watching this um i i felt like i had to go on and add more to this video because when i started they give you this card here um i mean by all means go to the, the website there it's, uh, it's gunnercrate.com forward slash value the password is gc value so you go there, and they don't even give you the value of nothing. What they tell you is, you know, they just um, 
tell you what's in the box. And uh, they don't give you no prices or nothing or anything. Um, but looking at the prices that we got, because you got to think, when these companies buy this stuff, they're buying this. Okay, so say this is $20, and they buy hundreds of them. They're now getting them for five, ten dollars, and you don't you don't even hit the value of what you paid for this box. So Gunner Crate, please, I hope you see this video. Um, the newest, best Gunner box out there, uh, BS flag, highest priced, highest shipping cost, least value in the box. That's all I have to say for Gunner Crate.